OR impacking. Texture artists, if you aren't already doing this, please give me 30 seconds to explain why it's so important. Whenever you export your textures from Substance Painter, 3D Code, or whatever software that you're working at, it's going to generate all of your maps individually. That means that roughness, ambient occlusion, metalness, they're each isolated in their own separate files. But you can and should create what is called an ORM map to contain all three of these maps into one singular map. This new singular map should store ambient occlusion, roughness, and metalness in RGB channels respectively. This means that your ambient occlusion map is plugged into the red channel, your roughness goes into the green channel, and metalness into the blue channel. Hence why we call it an ORM map because it stands for occlusion, roughness, metalness, and order of RGB. It's not only more convenient for you or anyone else on your team that has to work with the maps, but this process saves a ton of storage space over time. Now, if you already have your maps individually exported, you can either re-export them with these settings in Substance Painter, or you can take them into Photoshop and create an ORM map yourself using the levels adjustment. And seriously, don't worry, the process of packing your maps does not compromise any of the quality or detail. It's industry standard, so just start incorporating it into your workflow as soon as possible. And hey, if you're new here, my name is Levi Stone. You can check me out on Gumroad, CG Trader, Fab, wherever you buy your digital assets. And whether you're working in films or games, you should always be using.